My name is Evan. I go by Prince Predator. I'm a senior in aerospace engineering and I make beats for fun. My name is Jonathan Cabongo. I am a senior creative writing major. I'm also a rap artist. I definitely learned to appreciate the art of literature and writing through rap music. Music to me is freedom. It's creativity. It's just, it's doing things my way. I write about my life and what I like to consume my mind with. One of the key things in my process is sampling. I listen to the entire song and I start to chop the song up and pull out parts of it that are sonically interesting to me. It's taking a song that already exists and taking elements of it and incorporating a new song of your own creation to create something entirely new. Now this particular song is called Mysterious Vibes, it's by the Blackbirds. I already knew the song, like the sample, right? He sends me a file and I see Mysterious Vibes. I'm like, did he sample Mysterious Vibes? So I click it and I hear the sample and I'm like, okay, let me restart. Like, let me, let me, let me brace myself. I heard it and immediately I wanted to sample it. I went and downloaded the song and just started chopping it up and creating. Somebody told me that only you can do what you do. Like nobody else is gonna chop that up the same way I do it. So this is FL Studio. It's a digital audio workstation, but this song, the backbone of it is this chop right here. So one of the first things I did was I pitched it down a whole step just to make it sound darker. And after that, I actually reversed it to make it sound even more interesting. And then after that, I still wasn't satisfied, so I kind of created my own melody. It sounds like this. I've heard people sample it before, and you know, people have done a great job sampling it. But the way he sampled it and the way he added his own type of flavor to it. It just shocked me, to be honest. Like, I, I couldn't believe it. The lyrics were just coming. From there, I kind of just meditated on it for the rest of the week, and I came, I said, Evan, look, like, this is, we gotta do this, we gotta record, this is fire. Yeah. You good? Uh. Look, listen. Mysterious vibes, mysterious times All my close friends suffering, pretending they fine I'm just like everybody else, but I'm still one of a kind They can't look you in the eye, and that's just one of the signs They ain't really, they got something to hide Let me not assume it's possible the person just shy But then the question is why The title Mysterious Vibes spoke to this time that we're in right now so much that I didn't want to change the name It feels like the second verse is seeing the news and then being able to walk inside the screen. There's polarization, contradiction, and, and paradoxes with everything that's going on from the pandemic to the summer that we had with you know, police killings and all sorts of things. So it's like, I definitely feel like that's what that song embodies. This mysterious aspect of life that you can't really explain, but makes sense. And that's very universal to everybody. It just feels like sometimes like we can be a walking contradiction. Things don't work together and that's how it's supposed to be. Life just doesn't make sense and that's how it's supposed to be.